we present to you the tiger spider, also known as Cytodes globula. In previous videos, we have been fortunate to observe its impressive hunting skills. Unlike other spiders that weave webs to hunt, or even shoot silk from their abdomens, this spider has the extraordinary ability to shoot extremely strong and sticky silk at incredible speed through its jealous array. Before starting the video, we will test its extraordinary ability with a drain fly, also known as Psychoda. This fly feeds on and is attracted to decaying matter in areas of high humidity. As soon as it perceived the presence of this unsettling looking fly, our spider instantly sprang into action to hunt it. With a single shot of its silk, it captured the psychoda fly without any problem, and we decided to give it another one to continue feeding it. Its reaction was so quick that we barely had time to capture the moment it expelled its silk. With apparent ease, it managed to capture it once again. Interestingly, these spiders prefer to inhabit our homes, making them their refuge where they find shelter from the cold and always have available prey to hunt. Although they may appear slow and clumsy, their movements are meticulously calculated to stalk and launch their ambush undetected. But what would happen if it encountered another spider? Pay attention to these incredible images, where we can observe how the tiger spider reacts upon noticing the presence of a false black widow near its prey. The other spider is a stetoda, and although it is considerably larger than the cytodes, both are tiny in size. The tiger spider shoots but does not advance, suggesting that its shot was a warning to scare away and repel the stetoda. The venom of the cytodes is composed mainly of proteolytic enzymes that break down the tissues of its prey, while that of the stetoda contains more potent neurotoxins to paralyze prey by affecting their nervous system. But despite the cytodes venom being less potent, it holds a secret weapon the web it shoots is coated with toxins, a venom specially designed to incapacitate its prey on contact, making their capture and digestion easier. Accidentally, the tiger spider gets caught in one of the threads expelled by the false widow, an extremely dangerous situation that forces it to quickly free itself. The other spider prefers to opt for caution, avoiding provoking the cytodes. But both know there is prey at stake, and neither is willing to share it. The stetoda prepares to execute her ultimate strategy filling the terrarium with silk threads to hinder and possibly trap the tiger spider. This epic encounter we witness between the two spiders frequently occurs in the dark and most inaccessible corners of our homes, where they vie for control of the territory to establish their colonies. We observe the tiger spider retreating, leaving the captured fly vulnerable to the other spider, which is known for its ability to steal prey from its counterparts. But the stetoda neglects the drain fly and approaches the tiger spider dangerously. The precise shot from the cytodes leaves the stetoda completely trapped and vulnerable. Fortunately for her, the tiger spider decides to move away. Let's watch the moment again in slow motion. The tiger spider waits patiently for the precise moment to have her within reach and shoot, demonstrating that spiders are not completely blind and that they can see. Let's watch it again. The 
the spider quickly manages to free herself, demonstrating great strength. The large size of this male stetoda probably makes the cytodes, accustomed to capturing smaller prey, limit herself to scaring him away rather than trying to capture him. This female tiger spider seems to have infinite ammunition and a very bad temper, shooting her toxin every time she gets the chance. Spiders of the genus Cytodes are recognized for their ability to hunt by stalking their prey rather than weaving conventional webs, which they need to ensure the success of their ambushes. These spiders are often found on walls and vertical surfaces, strategically positioned to capture flying insects. The stetoda takes advantage of the tiger spider's absence to feed on the fly, a somewhat risky feat, but one that can secure her an important feast. These spiders have a peculiar way of interacting with their food being expert weavers, they usually use their web to completely wrap their prey and then lift them off the ground, hanging them in the air with their threads to avoid attracting other predators, such as ants. After freeing herself numerous times from the cytode's web, the stetoda begins to lose her fear, while the cytodes realizes this and tries to retreat as far as possible. A single silk discharge from the stetoda could have serious consequences. Finally, the false widow took the tiger spider's prey, forcing her to flee with no other option. If you liked this video, please give it a like and subscribe to continue watching this content.